Welcome back to the channel. This is Chai. We're back here with the Star family. We have Orion here that needs to go to sleep. <laughs> of course, we start with, you know, the tradition, age old tradition is here that we have to start off the episode with at least one person going to sleep. You know that's the way this is here. And then we have Cameron who needs to go to the bathroom and we need to see how much we need to do to finish this dang servo for the last time. Oh my god, we only need two more mechanisms. Craft materials, mechanism, and mechanism, and then we're making that thing today. Okay, my goal for today. Um, I know Saturday, let's, let's check the calendar and make sure. I know Saturday we have the prom, I believe, right? Yes. We have the prom, and Orion has asked his friend... Jaden and he is asked Wednesday. No, I she looks like Wednesday, but she's not Wednesday. He asked Cassandra to prom, so we'll be going to that. Sunny here needs to get her aspiration done once and for all. Once she's done with that, um, we probably have this episode and maybe one more, and then we're gonna move on to Orion's uh, let's play. His, his section of the group. All right, so what do we got here? Sunny is finishing this painting. We are making progress on this aspiration. We are at 139,364 of 200,000. Let's see how far we can get with this today. Hopefully quite far. Orion, for his aspiration, needs to meet... Two more people in different locations. Oh my god, Sonny's made a masterpiece. This is absolutely phantasmo. 1879. We're going to put that in her wall over there. And then how are her needs? Can she do another painting? She absolutely can. So let's do a confident painting since she's confident. Cameron has, of course, not done everything that I've asked. We are going to complete another mechanism. I think he... Yeah, he only has one more to go. Is the servo going to be worth it? We'll see. Oh my gosh, Cameron. You can go to the bathroom. It's okay. And as per usual, it also wouldn't be an episode without Kano pooping on the porch. What do we have here points-wise for people? We have 1,005 points for Orion. What the heck, Cameron? Use the bathroom. What are you doing? I don't know about these Sims. I literally, why would you walk from the bathroom up here to this one and now back down? Oh my goodness. Oh no. I keep getting sidetracked. Okay. Orion has 1,005 reward points. I want to get him as much stuff as I can get him before he becomes an adult. Um, what do we got that's a thousand that he could, that could be useful for him? He already has morning sim. I said I was going to get night owl, so let's do that so he can get his skills up quicker. What are you doing, Cameron? Why are you going, what the heck is going on? You know, I just started the episode and I guess we already have sims that need to be reset. Would you just use the stinking bathroom, please? For the love of goodness, finally. Oh my goodness, Cameron. You know, my game makes me insane. <laughs> it's like they cannot ever just fully sleep through the night. I don't understand it. Stop drinking in the puddles, Kano. You know, all these other tricks and everything, but you, all you want to do is do bad things. All right, Sonny, since you wanted to get up, you can go paint another painting anyway. <laughs> Let's just have you do that. Uh, we'll do an impressionism painting. So when uh, when's Orion going to get up when he's not fully rested? That's what I'm waiting for. What the heck? I have a pop art painting that's been sitting here this whole time. <laughs> oh, I was dragging it outside and it probably got stuck. Oh, that's great. All right, Sonny's done another masterpiece. Why don't we keep up with our tradition that we did last episode? It's 3.49 a.m. Let's do some night sales. Anybody out there? Anybody going to spawn in and buy my beautiful paintings? Looks like some guy's right here. Oh, there's somebody right here. He's coming along. Oh, there's, there's Mortimer Goth, too. 
Mortimer, what you got going on? You you got a library book in your hand at uh What is this? This looks like a children's book. What do you got going on at 4:24 a.m. walking down the street with a children's book? And this guy right here, he seems to be giving you the side eye. There's some issues with that. Mm-hmm. What you doing, Mortimer? As usual, too, kind of was out here for our support. Dang, that was quick. Judith Ward, you showing up and bringing it home, girl. Please tell me you're going to buy the most expensive one. Why is everyone leaving all of a sudden? All right, we're going to send him to school alone. And we are, since Cameron is getting up, we're going to get him a shower and get him something to eat. And then we're going to finish this mechanism. We're going to make this servo. All right, the time has arrived. He has finished his last mechanism. Let's craft the servo. I have been waiting for this for a long time. Don't let me down. Don't let me down, game. All right, Sonny, how are you on your sleep? You're good. Let's get up, go to the bathroom, and then we're going to do more paintings. Yay! After Cameron, depending on how long this takes... After Cameron is done with that, we're going to go do the course with Kano. And we're going to see how well he does since he is fully trained. Santa's calling. Quick question. Janae Price and I were planning to spend some cla some classic, some casual friend time together. Should I do it? I think you should go for it, Santa. Go for it. All right. We're going to hold off on crafting more of the servo right now. I have no clue why adult sims are constantly getting children stuff. What the heck is Cassandra do? Out of the blue. Cassandra, you are supposed to be at school. What are you doing? What are you doing in our house on our couch? All right, we're going to travel with Kano and go do this course and see what's up. All right, I'm here at the Pupperstone Park and guess what? I remembered Kano this time. Yay! All right, run obstacle course with Kano. Let's do this. How well are you going to do, Kano? Kano, are you coming through? You coming through there, buddy? Good boy. I believe he had... Um, I put it up in the last video up on the screen how many faults he had and what his time was. We'll have to compare. You got this, Kano. You're going to do good, buddy. Orion has returned from school. He's one of the top students at Copperdale High School. Keep up the good work. Orion, you are amazing. You are a highly trained dog, Kano. What are you doing? <laughs> you better be doing this good. Good boy. You got this. Orion is also off to the chess team activity. Good. Aw, amazing. Would you look at the... Oh my goodness. Kano has achieved a perfect run. On his course in 42 minutes. Wow, Cameron must be a first class pet training master. You gotta be kidding me, Smalls. That's awesome. Oh, this is awesome. He's so happy. Oh, that is creepy. Creepy that his head's still moving. Oh, I, they never fix things in The Sims. How creepy is that? Okay, we have to quit. <laughs> oh, you are so good, Kano. I'm proud of you, buddy. Let's give you a nice big treat. All right, we're back home with Kano. Yes. Champion pet. Cameron is super proud of his pet. Not very many pets could run that obstacle course so well. Cameron has some bragging rights now. You're right, he does. All right, let's go continue our servo. Cassandra, you're still at our house? What are you following? Hold on here. What are you following me around for? Wait a minute. Why are you... What are you doing? Cassandra? Um, Orion's not home. What are you do... What are you doing? Orion is not home, girl. What is happening here? And Kano is coming to visit you. When is Orion home? Why is she here? Are you here to see us? Or are you here to break up with us? Or what is going on? I don't even think we're going out yet. But 
So see, Cassandra's just here in, in this pose, and that's where she's going to stay? Um, all right. What is happening here? Oh my gosh. Is she, is, is she one of those girls that's like, wants to get with uh, Orion, and um, she comes in, into the house and is waiting for him on the bed when he gets home? We need to go up here and see what's popping with her. Discuss interests, I guess? Have you been waiting for me all this time? Like... What is going on? I guess we'll embrace. I don't want to kiss until prom if if that's the case. Aw, that's sweet. <laughs> we decided to embrace again. I mean, like, Cassandra, is it all right? Everything kosher? Rave about growing up. Let's do that. Brighten day. And then we'll go get some leftovers. I mean, Cassandra, are you showing up here like that and just coming in my house and sitting on my bed by yourself while everybody else is doing their own thing? It's kind of awkward. I guess we should meet um, Cassandra. Cheerful introduction. If you're going to be going to prom with my son, I kind of need to get to know who you are. Hi, Cassandra. I'm Sunny. I heard that you are going to prom with my son. I just wanted to make sure that everything was okay. And why did you come into our house and just go stay upstairs in Orion's room when he was gone? Oh, is it because you're afraid of bears? Oh, okay. No, there's just a lot of storm clouds going on at my house and everything has just been so terrible at home. I needed to get out of there for a little while. Things are not good at home. Oh, she said she wants to pack up her, her clothes and leave. She's like, well, let's just sit down and watch a little bit of TV, honey. Everything will be fine. Where did Cassandra go? Did she leave? Or did she go back up to the bed? Cassandra, what is up with you wanting to be in my bedroom? Monkey around. I would like to see what this interaction is. Oh, it's a joking one. Okay. He was actually already going up there to begin with because it wasn't taking him too long to go up the, to the room. Oh, that's typical teenage behavior. <laughs> Obsess about favorite video game? We can definitely do that. Okay, apparently it says Cassandra's already leaving. Oh, no. Is he getting sick? Oh, no. Orion's fighting an illness. Okay, we need to get on here and order some meds. Apparently she's just decided to hold and kiss Kano so much that it's... It, l l look at this. This must be a new glitch. She's doing this constantly. Okay, no more. No more. No more. Hey guys, it's 3.49 a.m. We need to stock the table. All right, we're here to activate the servo. Are you sure you want to activate this servo? Yes. Choose the servo's program gender. Hmm. We'll do female since the house is predominantly male. <laughs> this is cool. Hopefully it works right. All right. Let's pause this and read here. Servo has been activated. Servos don't need sustenance or restrooms, but they do need to watch their charge levels and keep their durability in good shape. Servo can be enhanced to improve her charge and durability capacities. With enough enhancements, she can also learn to repair herself and gain access to special programming behaviors. Okay. Can we name her? You can be woohoo partners with your servo. Um, okay. Modify servo. Oh, rename. Okay, good. Found it. Are you going to rename the servo after? Okay, thank you. We're going to name this servo. I have thought about this. I'm going to name it P2MD. And here's why. P2 Mighty Ducks. <laughs> that is the name of our servo. p 2 MD. Hell yeah. Kano, you're sick. You got hot feet, buddy. Oh, no. All right, we have returned back home from the vet. Oh, little Kano, we need to give you a treat there, buddy. Give vet treat. Oh, I hate it when animals are sick. That's no good. Oh, Kano, you, your little nose is toasted. All right, little buddy, there you go. You're all better now. That's a good boy, pet. Okay, now what are you doing here? What is this with all these teens coming to my house throughout the middle of the day? What are you doing here? Oh my goodness, what is going on? 
Is Orion becoming a hot commodity or something? <laughs> and now the servo's laying up here on my bed. Just make yourself at home, P2. Make yourself at home. <laughs> what are you doing? Modify P2MD. Uh, program, reprogram traits. I don't even know what their traits are. Let's see, what are their traits? Your traits are freaking insider and art lover. All right, I kind of like those traits. No, no need to remodify that. Um, you seem to be a little flirty with my servo there, Billy. <laughs> this, this game is getting awkward. Okay, Love Day School Party. All week at school, kids had been asking their sweethearts to the annual Love Day School Party. There will be cookies and punch, music, the exchanging of flowers and cards, and of course, awkward chaperones. Orion had yet to be asked, so we had two options. Go alone or invite someone special. I want to invite someone special. It took courage. That's what Orion would have to keep telling himself. The moment he asked that special sim to the Love Day party was the exact same moment he got shot down. Well, damn that. The response, no, had been instantaneous and followed by the cruel snickers of the classmates. Orion spent the party hiding in the bathroom, embarrassed, with a llama cookie, which was delicious, but didn't make up for what had just happened. Well, that sucks. Billy, what are you doing in my house? If you even seriously sit down here flirting with my dad, there's going to be some issues, girl. There's going to be some serious issues. I am not certain why all these teens are coming over right in the middle of the school day. So, Billy, you think you can just come to my house and take out my matcha cake and just eat food and everything? What is wrong with you people? Can I just ask you to go home? Send home. Billy, you don't need to be here when my son is at school. I'm glad you enjoyed your piece of cake. Now get out. Give Love Day gift to your wife. What are you going to give her? Um, you can give her the experimental tidy motivator that you have. Say you made it for her to help clean the house. Should Orion invite over classmate Amy? Okay, but I was actually going to, you know what, if you want to come over, Amy, that's kosh. But what we're going to do is we're going to go do a little bit of his aspiration. It is Friday. We can go travel with Amy to a different location, and we have to meet some people in different locations. So we're going to go to San Myshuno. All right, we have arrived at San Myshuno. And we're going to try to meet, uh, it says in the aspiration, meet someone new in three different locations. All right, we are going to go see Beth Sterling. Friendly introduction. All right, we have done that. Let's talk to, let's talk to Amy a little bit. Ask for reassurance. See if that helps me get my mortification down just a little bit. All right, Sunny has returned home with Moolah. Amy, where did you go? Amy, oh, there you are. What you want, Gideon? Have you seen the latest concert going on just outside of town? We have to go see it together. This is a chance of a lifetime. No, Gideon, I'm sorry. I'm actually hanging out with Amy right now. My apologies. Orion has learned how to make bruschetti. So far, he has discovered two of 27 recipes available in the city. I have no idea where he found the other ones, but okay. Um, He has come here because over here... Ooh, Cameron earned a raise of $14 an hour. He now makes $5.35. I will take that. He has come here because he is scoping out apartments. Because he is looking for one. He's going to be turning 18 soon. Going to be going to be becoming an adult soon. And he wants to scope out apartments and see what might be interesting for him to purchase later on. Because, you know, obviously he was born into some money and he is going to be given some money to purchase one for when he goes to college. All right, let's travel to another location so we can get this part of the aspiration done. I won't travel with Amy. She just wanted to come with us to go look at apartments. You know what? I think we're going to go to Newcrest because I did also put in a pizza place at Newcrest. Where is it at? Nino's Pizza. And it is a convivial chef's kitchen party place to hang out at so let's go there how cute is this place it's awesome um if anyone's interested in downloading this this is nino's pizza and the creator is a underscore morning star with two r's 
And this is a thing I have decided to use off and on for people to go out to eat at. So let's go in here and check out what's going on. Can we go request a table? Let's do that. We're here by ourselves. We're here by ourselves because we're treating ourselves to a meal because we have been made fun of at school and our love day interest didn't want to, want to go out with us. All right, we have made it to the table. Order for table. We're gonna get a lemon seltzer water and some sweet corn pizza. Let's go introduce ourselves to this person so we can get this aspiration part up. All right, we got that for 300 points. We need to work on our charisma skill as well. While we are waiting, can we do our homework? I don't know. Let's do homework. See if that can see if that works. Yes, we can. No harm in doing that while we wait for our pizza. Kano messaged us. He said curfew's about to start. If you don't go home soon, you'll get in trouble. Oh, Kano, thanks. All right, food's here. And my book is right in my food. Sweet. Eat our sweet corn and then head home so we don't get too too in trouble. All right, we need to head out the door here. End meal and pay 16 bucks. All right, we're back home and we are going to finish up our homework and then we're gonna head to bed because prom is tomorrow. So I'm in bed sleeping and all of a sudden, Jace Laurent just comes up into my room and is standing here staring at me. I do not get what is going on with this game. All right, Orion, your sleep seems to be good. Let's get you some leftovers and, well, let's fill Kano's bowl first. And you can get some leftovers. And Sunny, what, where is Kano? He looked to me like he needed a bath. Oh, yeah. Prom should be, when is prom? What time is it? It should be, I don't know why I keep clicking on the wrong button. Prom is uh, 7 p.m. Okay. Cassandra wants to take things to the next level. Will Orion be her boyfriend? Oh, Cassandra. Of course. Of course. There, of course I will be. That's amazing. I love it. And it was on prom day too. Oh, she's here. She is here. Oh, we can have our first kiss, but I was wanting to save that for prom. We can save it for prom in a couple hours, Cassandra. We'll hug lovingly, though. See, after it wasn't uh, her being uh, distant after all. She did like us. If things go well through college and everything, um, I'm hoping for them to be together and this is who he ends up with and they can have cute, cute babies. We have an hour and a half until prom starts. Did Cassandra just pick up the dog poop that was on my porch and take it? It is certified that Orion is a healthy baby boy. Um, I kind of already know that. I knew that when I was born literally like years ago in The Sims. You know what? Let's, let's talk to mom for a little bit. Be like, mom, I need you to give me some pep talk about how prom is going to go for me. I need, I need some talking. Is it going to be okay? Advice, mom. This is going to be, I'm planning on kissing Cassandra. This is going to be my first kiss. My first kiss. I don't want to stumble around and act like a T-Rex. I just, I want to... You know, and I also don't want, you know, her to be kissing a frog and thinking that it's a prince and then maybe I'm not as great. You never know. I, I know we have chemistry. I just want to make sure everything's going to be okay. It's all going to be okay, Orion. Just take it one step at a time. Don't, you know, you can, you and her both love video games. Just make sure you shower and that you don't stink. Prom. It's time for prom. Get dressed up and rock the dance floor. With other high school students, will you a trend? Yes, we will. Travel to prom with Orion. First things first, though. We gotta go to the bathroom, of course, because we don't want anything to ruin this. All right, we're here at prom. I have no idea why we showed up with the de grocery delivery boy. I know he's a teen, but first things first, let's go to the bathroom. Let's go to the bathroom real quick. And then we're going to go vote for prom queen because I know that takes a while. 
Why is my teacher standing at the bathroom stall talking to me? Get out of here. All right, where do we vote? We vote right here. Vote for prom royalty, okay? We want to vote for Cassandra. Use photo booth with Cassandra. Take a photo with, take a romantic photo with Cassandra. Those glasses look awesome on her. Good, Orion's leveled up his charisma skill to four. This is awesome. Milestone complete. Good deal. What we we did that one. Okay. Now we need to achieve charisma. He has 12 friends. He needs to achieve level six charisma skill. Okay. I'm gonna go get a photo in the photo booth. Gotta get all this hopefully done before the end of the prom. Alright, we did that. We did use the photo booth. I have no idea why this didn't work. Let's go dance. Slow dance together with Cassandra. We don't have a lot of time, peeps. Sydney's definitely getting around. He's dancing with tons of people. Awesome. How sweet. Prom ceremony starting. Attention, everybody. We have the results. Oh, prom royalty was Cassandra God. Yes. Yes. Amazing. Orion, post something on Social Bunny. Everything has to happen so quick here. It's ridiculous. Okay, new post. Post about prom. Happy narrative. Oh, where is Cassandra? Cassandra's over here. Let's let's uh, have our first kiss because you're so happy. Kano, don't be talking to me about my curfew. This is my prom night. Oh, that's so sweet. And you know, we did we we did things. It's just I don't understand why we didn't get this up. We've used the photo booth. <laughs> Orion's like, yeah, look at Cassandra's butt. Nice. Alright, we are done with prom and it was unsuccessful and it shouldn't have been because I tried. I truly did. Alright, we have arrived back home. It is past midnight. I know we broke curfew by over an hour, but that's okay. You know, mom, mom's already up here in the bed. And she wants to talk about uh, what has happened at prom. So we will sit there and do that and let her know about what happened. Um, enthuse about comedy. Sure, we'll do that. Uh, I wish there was a thing to tell about prom. That would be nice. Oh, Dad came upstairs to see what was going on, too. Awesome. All right, I guess we're going to sit back to back to find out how prom was. He was like, you know, I, I really tried to sit there and dance and everything else, and I showed off my muscles. Everything was going great. Cassandra got prom queen, which was amazing. Dad said, I've heard enough. That's great, son. Now I'm just going to go to the bathroom. She's like, oh, did you make sure to post on social, Bunny? Of course I did, Mom. All right, well, they sit and talk about how the events of prom went. We're going to leave this part here. Lots has actually happened today. We did more of our aspiration. We're on the second part now. We are working on another part of Cameron's aspiration, but that's really not too important. But the best thing that we've done is made a crap load of progress on this fabulously wealthy aspiration. We started out with like 130 something thousand. We're now at 164. We only have about uh, 36,000, 35,000 left to go. And then we will be completely done with this part of the Let's Play. And we will be moving out Orion into his new apartment. So next episode should be, I'm in hopes, the last one. We'll grind out a bunch of paintings and get those done. Okay, if you have any feedback or suggestions, please leave them in the comments below. And also subscribe if you enjoyed the video so you won't miss any new content from me in the future. Until next time, have a wonderful day.